is identification required. Please repeat the following words. Bovine, doctrine, antipathy, pencil. Bovine, doctrine, antipathy, pencil. Holy crap, it worked. Nice. All right, boys. Let's do this. Interesting. Welcome to deep storage. If Talos One had a subconscious, this would be it. You're looking for the central repository. That's where you stash the drive that has the plan for your arming key. I'll see if I can find a way out of here in the meantime. Um, mean Akande's a nice guy. You ripped open a nine in my brain. I see a horizon filled with teeth. <sighs> it is coming closer. Maybe it is what you see? I'm hungry. I'm always hungry. I will wait in you. You will come out. Nowhere to go. Nowhere to go. What the hell? Uh, guy who could blame him for trying to get off corrective and wanting a real desk instead of a card table. He sits out there all by himself with nothing to do. I feel sorry for him. You should try to be nicer to him. I don't like mean people. The hell? I just went to Zachary West. <clears throat> Treasure hunt. Oh, man. Every dark bit of data that moves through the station is captured here. Redundant backup servers are stored in modules that eject in the event of a catastrophic failure. The fact that they haven't yet is telling of Alex's refusal to face reality. Oh, great. Little D show. Alex, you, good operator. Oh, D show. Thomas, Heather, Andrew, misdirection demands money. Holden, trooper, what? Janos, operator, a trooper. Trooper, bad operator. Illuminati, Ivy, jellyfish, starfish, jelly star. Trans star. Mary, who's that? Jessica. Indigo. Lake. Your operator is in grave danger. Give us money now. Danielle. Same color marker. All caps. Fancy shadow. We have your operator. What? The hell is that? What the hell does that even mean? You know, freaky bee. Hey, Ivy, Benin was snooping around my desk looking for rats again. He's so weird. I mean, rats in space? He was acting all big city cop. News flash. No crime in orbit. They need to ship him home. I think you should talk to him. I don't like the way he looks at you. And make sure you get the fab plan I sent you. You have to play the game with me. Everybody's in. Play with me, babe. Huntress Bullcaster. Danielle Show. Thief Archivist. Normal Phantom. Are you kidding me? Got him. 
Security key. Okay, cool. What? Okay, I'm going to have to look at that here in a second. Arrow mods. Asteroid fragment. Um, alright. That fire noise is really kind of annoying. Uh, no subject. Alex, you, Danielle, show. Uh, Michelle, I wanted to remind you that we have some sensitive information regarding the volunteers, and I'd like you to make sure it's secure. We'll also include fabrication plans for some charges that you should transfer to storage. Those were recycler chargers, weren't it? Um... Uh, Danielle show to Dr. Yu. Uh, rogue operator. I spoke to Lorenzo Calvino and got no response, so bringing the matter to you. There's evidence of an unlicensed operator aboard Talos 1. If so, we might be risking another Transtar North incident. Why not ensure the crew's station safety and make sure IT protocols are enforced? That explains why she was so hardcore about the IT stuff. Uh, Chief Show, I doubt that incident accident has any relevance to what you're describing here. If Lorenzo says an investigation is unnecessary, I believe him. Uh, Dr. Yu, an operator follows an owner's, com owner's commands to the letter. Uh, Morgan may have built an unlicensed model, and if so, it would have access to station protocols. I'll take the matter out to the board if I have to, but I won't have Morgan's actions place the station in jeopardy. Are you certain of this? If this operator exists, where would it be? Oh, no. And the treasure hunt. Charge plans. Here's your map. Melindra Shadow Corner. ELB. Okay. And now I have the charge plans. Um, tracking bracelet protocol. Sending a kill signal to a tracking bracelet is a violation of transfer policy. Do not deactivate a tracking bracelet for any reason without proper authorization. Tracking bracelets ensure all transfer personnel can be located in the event of an emergency. Modifying a tracking bracelet must have written approval. May only be deactivated by those with director level clearance. Wait, so that means that other one may have been deactivated intentionally. Enter bracelet ID. Oh shit, what's the bracelet ID? Employee 1129. Okay. Current Lockwood? Yes. Track and bracelet 1129 activated. Okay. Go to deep storage. Employee. Activate current Lockwood's track and bracelet. Deep storage. Okay, Grant Lockwood. Tell us one exterior. He oh, no, he's on the exterior, so he's probably dead. Um, what's this? Deactivated. Vincent Schubel. Issue new tracking bracelet. Adrian Holland. I don't have hacking too, so I can't get him. Okay, cool. Uh, drop and shell fabrication plan. Oh, nice. Take ammo. Take ammo. Actually, I can take both of those. Null wave transmitter. EMP charge. Fabrication plan and weapon upgrade kit. Hell yeah. Null wave transmitter. Developed in psychotronics, the null wave transmitter emits a burst of signals which suppress the psionic abilities of anyone caught in the blast for a short period of time. Be thrown or affixed to stationary objects. That's awesome. Um, okay. Enjoy prosperity access control grant access. Um critical errors occurred with the access control system will reschedule an engineer diagnose problem. Meantime, central repository access control unavailable. Oh great. I guess because it can't close now. Zero gravity transition. Microgravity detected. Oh. Okay. 
behind the drive deep storage. I need to get to that computer, don't I? Drive installation. Please ensure all drives meet transfer company only ensure progress. Not to drive. Oh, I don't have a drive. Plug in it and mount the drive. Okay. Drive detected. Proceed to install screen. Okay. Process restore from backup. Log in and mount the drive. Drive installed. Good work. I was worried the drive might have been damaged. You can use Chief Show's workstation to download the fabrication plan. Then we can reconstruct your arming key. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Problem gravity detected. No. Oh. Files. UM Arming Key. Warning. Central repository is a secure data facility. Please obtain proper authorization before transfer files. Fuck it. Oh, you son of a bitch. You got the power. Get Alex's arm and key. Wait, what? Fabricate your arm and key. Oh, okay. Morgan, Alex has you boxed in. Look, there's nothing I can do about the lockdown from out here. But I promised I'd help you. So listen. Deep storage was built with a series of data vault modules that can be jettisoned from the station. It's a redundant backup system. That's your way out. Look at my workstation again. I'm exposing a utility that'll open up one of the vaults. Once you're in, look for a manual release. Then your ass is space junk, like me. And if you manage to get back inside, remember, you owe me. Kill the son of a bitch who hurt Abby, or I swear to God I'll haunt you. Go to one of the freaking... go. There's like, there's a handful of fucking, oh, kill the imposter cook, yeah. There's a handful of freaking things that she can, like uh, airlocks that she can go through. But she, it's like, what? Go through it. Morgan's arming key. Okay, fabricate your arming key. Cool, I got it. already ejected default B. Unlocked. Okay. Now we gotta go back in there, I think, right? Escape deep storage. Oh, yeah, that's this one. Data vault. How the hell do I get in there? That's hilarious. I managed to actually... Oh, fuck it up. Hey, cool, I didn't get shocked. Oh, come on. Um. Okay. Okay, well, that worked out. I don't know how, but it did. Holy crap, okay. Oh, you poor bastard. I kind of been in. Well, I mean, it's a good thing he had the shotgun, at least for me, but it's a shame that it didn't help him any. Oh, great. Oh, 
Okay, cool. And you're graying. Oh, you poor bastard. Radioactive waste. Oh, yep, there goes that one. That, one's, that was the one that was jettisoned, it looks like. Okay, so here's the other one. Alright, so we're literally about to use this almost like a freaking, like a escape shuttle. I guess technically you could, it looks like. <laughs> I totally did. <laughs> Holy shit. Genius. Okay, now the question is, how the hell do I get out? Oh. Well, that probably knocked us out for a few hours. Microgravity detected. You're not what they say you are. What? That's the second time we've seen that. This is still a window, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. I didn't see that. That's freaking stupid. That's all it took. Morgan? Morgan, this is Chief Elazar. The airlocks on Talos are sealed, but there's a, an opening at the cargo bay you could use. I think you can get back inside the station here. Does that get to the cargo bay? Morgan, I've been wondering if it might be bothering you that you planned your own death. It's a lot to swallow. My advice would be... Try not to think about the end. Focus on what's in front of you, one step at a time. I'm here if you need help. Damn you. I find you outside your prison. We've been trying to escape. Like me? Not safe out there. Well, you know this. You have headaches. Not hallucinations. A horizon is coming, cutting through space. If we are still here when it arrives, it screams so loud. We hear it in our head. It is still far away, but it is coming closer. It will eat your prison, every person on board, and it will still be hungry. Where will it go next, I wonder? I see you back in your prison soon, damn you. This is Dr. Dayo Igwe. I'm broadcasting to all contacts in proximity. Please, whoever is out there, listen to me. Oxygen is low and I have no spacesuit. An accident in Cargo Bay forced me to seal myself inside this container. But I have no way to dock with the station from in here. Oops. I see you, Morgan. We've locked down the cargo bay. We're safe. For the moment. It will be a trick to get inside. There's not an airlock anymore. That explosion took care of that. Maybe you can do something with the shipping containers. Aviation Seek medical attention. Enter container number 2312. Container controls remotely maneuver and operate the chosen shipping container. Dock shipping container. Open shipping container. Dock shipping container. Container moves into position. Fuck yeah. I think we just saved this guy. Oh, at last. I thought that crate would be my coffin. Even the stale air of Talos laced with a faint hint of nicotine and antibacterians. Oh, it's like spring. You are my thanks, Dr. Yu. But I thought... Well, you're no longer running the memory hamster wheel, I see. I hope you're coming in after me. Would be good to see a familiar face. 
and transmitting the code to the crate I was in. Noise. Two three one two. Should we container two three one two? You found Dr. Igwe. He worked in the simulation lab and in psychotronics. He might be helpful, but he's unlikely to approve of your mission, despite everything he suffered. Though I will note, he's always admired you and Alex quite a bit. Nine two six three. Noise, noise, noise. There we go. Fuck yes, boys. Okay, we made it to the cargo bay. Holy crap. There's so much going on. Ugh. But I, from what I can tell, the majority of the survivors that are like, have been able to gather together, they're all in the cargo bay, from what I can tell. Based on the information that we've gotten so far. So we'll see how this goes. Fuel storage bay, shipping and receiving. Doctor Yu! Morgan! Up here, Officer Cool! If we can't open the main door or our friends are gonna pour through, get up to the catwalk. We'll get you inside. Hey, okay. how do I get to the catwalk? I love how he was like, I see you're no longer doing the memory hamster wheel. Good to have you back. It's like, bruh. You knew. You were one of them. It's okay though, it's not a big deal. Um I love how he was like, get up to the you know, get on up here, get up to the catwalk. Okay, how do I get up to the catwalk, dude? Like seriously. Remind me never to cross you. He killed them all. Uh, let me open the door, sir. Oh, so I don't have to. So okay, so I it was either get up to the catwalk and go through that way, or literally just slaughter them all and come through here. Hell yeah. <laughs> all right, buddy, you can close it now. Let's go to unlock that up. How about we go and lock that up? Okay, fine then. I guess just leave it wide open, buddy. That's genius. I heard Dr. Igwe was floating in a cargo crate outside the ship. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than any of us. Uh, Dr. Igwe not. is blessed. It was fortunate you came along when you did. Yeah, no kidding. Poor bastard was just chilling out there, locked up in that thing. It's one hell of a freaking um, coffin. Hey, buddy. How you doing? I'll fuck you up later. God, watching those things move makes me sick. Yeah, no kidding. I... What is it doing? Oh my God, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things, like it, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. Ugh. Maybe. I don't know, maybe. Maybe it saved him. Could still be Enoch. It could still be Enoch. No, it's not, buddy. Trust me. Does it look like it? Sam, promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now. The off food and supplies. I've got all the supplies I could find, and it looks like we have enough food to hold out for several days, as long as we are rationing. Here's an inventory. <laughs> I'm about to steal all of this shit. Follow what you need as long as the fountain keeps working. The collected those supplies. They're not for you. She actually commented on the fact that I was just taking it all. Well, sorry, sweetheart, but I need it more than you do. Trust me. You'll probably be dead here in about a little bit. Knowing how this game has been going, you're probably literally going to die. I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transstar mounting a rescue operation? <laughs> they don't even know. I swear, they don't even know what the hell's going on. I was in fuel storage when, when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But 
they weren't running from the fire. It was these shapes. I had contained the fire, and I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those things. Everyone I worked with, they're dead, aren't they? I uh, wonder if probably. one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? Uh, sort of, it seems. I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? That was probably Alex, to be honest. Let's be honest. That was probably Alex. He probably shut all those fucking things down. He probably locked those things down tight before, like, when all this broke How out. How did this all happen? So he didn't want no one to, get ex to freaking escape. Uh, it completed within six hours of the incident. Fuel storage and fuel details of incident accident occurred during fuel transfer. The blast walls held. Now the blast door is closed and the damage contained, but we lost some crew in there. Para has been knocked out to multiple cargo systems. Can't get the resources I need to get in there. Everyone is tied up. I don't know. I'm filling this out because I don't know what else to do at this point. Talus is falling apart. Damaged equipment, damaged extent. Yeah. Um, has been transferred today. Um, good morning. Uh, delivery shuttle arrived uh, earlier with chlorine trifluoride aboard. It has been offloaded and awaits you in cargo bay A. I need everyone to in involved with the transfer to review procedures and protocols at the start of their shift today, as you will be the lucky individuals to get to escort these contents to fuel storage. I don't think I need to remind you what chlorine uh, will do if you mishandle it. Just ask Enoch, stick to procedures and everything will be fine. Once it's secured, I'll give you the rest of the sh I'll give you all the rest of the shift off. You're welcome. Uh, it's just <laughs> sad face. Anyway, temporary. Temporary assignment. Dr. Uh, Igwe assigned to your area temporarily. I've encouraged him to stay out of your way and avoid interacting with Carl Bay personnel. There are some incoming materials I'd like him to handle directly. His work is confidential and he answers directly to me. Um, so if you have any issues, please contact my office. Thank you, Sylvain Bellamy. Ah, so what was it? It seems there was still some weird stuff going on uh, in the background. Dr. Yu, Hi. again, I want to thank you for the timely rescue. I hope you recall me. Dr. Igwe, Dio Igwe, your brother, Alex, brought me to the station to head up Neuromod research. I have one, but no aptitude template. We're saving it, but, well, now might be best. Here, yeah, I'm sure you could make better use of it. What? Neuromod? Oh, hey. Thanks, bud. He gave me a new. He gave me another Nermod. I accidentally hit the scroll wheel. I didn't open that. I just I accidentally hit it. But I'm like yeah, yeah. Anyways, all right. Um, let's see. If you find a way out of here, take Doctor Igwe with you. Maybe he can be of some help Attention. elsewhere. Catastrophic breach in cargo bay one. All personnel. Morgan, you. I'm surprised you escaped Simlab. Yes, I knew about that. I checked the shuttle logs when the rumors about you being demoted started circulating. Demoted? All I found was you checked into the sim lab but never signed out. Not sure you could, but it seems you've escaped. Just like these creatures of yours. The ones your brother said couldn't get free. Wish I had better news. We're holding out here, but just barely. These standard issue PPNs might as well be cap guns for all the good they do to those things. Only way back into Talos is through Cargo Bay B, and that's locked tight for our safety. And yours. You want the code? Help us fortify things here. That means eradicator turrets, and lots of them. To do that, though, we'd need fabrication plans and a working fabricator, and both of those are out of reach at the moment. The fabrication plan is in the safe in the security office, but the hull breach puts it out of my reach. Still, if you have a suit and are up for another walk, we could really use the additional firepower. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember, the only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive. Hey, Any luck I got with you. those turrets? Oh, really? You literally just told me about it. Don't, don't, don't be giving me that shit. Dr. Ewe. Any luck with the lifts? Dr. Igwe figures he'd survive. Dumb luck, I suppose. Damn, they really don't like him. He seemed nice enough. Okay, retrieve the turret fabrication plan. Hey, are you there? Chief? The 
Jess? Is there something wrong? I wanted to speak to you about the most recent VIP visit. Leitner, the pianist. Chief, if there were any problems, I checked the schedule, the roster. I did my best to make sure Igwe wasn't too... Remember, Igwe. it's the eradicated Chief, fabrication plan we want. Not the you did an excellent plan. job. Whatever In fact, Leitner is. praised you specifically. There'll be a bonus for you in your next pay cycle. Take Nicole out for a nice dinner, all right? Yes, Chief. Thank you, Chief. Huh. Okay. Okay, so we, we got a few things to do. Um, we're going to go ahead and save. Um, like, actual manual save. All right, boys, this is where I'm going to end it for tonight. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.